Act uh, completed uh, his visit to the Rajghat to pay his respects to Mahatma Gandhi on India's 76th Independence Day. The Prime Minister will be getting into his convoy now and heading straight to the Lal Kas Live this morning and has uh, been kind enough to give us his time. And remember, I always insist on having a well-known military veteran on our coverage of Independence Day because remember, independence is very much also about the amazing sacrifices our military has made. And remember, even now, there are many who wish to trample on India's sovereignty. Very good morning to you, General Dillon. As we await the Prime Minister at the Red Fort, a lot of military elements and fervor today also at Red Fort. As usual, a lovely sight for every Indian general. Uh, good morning to you, Shiv, and good morning to all the viewers. Wishing everyone a very happy Independence Day and 75 years of independence today. 75 years is a very short time in a nation's history, but our civilization, our culture goes back to 5,000 years. And we are proud of it. And today, to start with, we wish everyone a very happy Independence Day, Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav, Mahotsav, and 75 years of independence. As you rightly said, yes. India's enemies are waiting on the borders in the country to create problems for us. But we as a nation will stand strong always and every time. Always and every time. And that's a message that all of our military personnel, and remember right through our coverage this morning uh, that G General Dillon and I will be bringing to you, are going to be images of the Tiranga at the border. And this is not some artificial thing. As General Dillon will tell you, the Tiranga has a special symbolism, a special significance for the armed forces personnel because it is on the Tiranga that they are commissioned. It is on the Tiranga that they enter service. It is on the Tiranga that the, their entire lives actually pan out. Am I right, General Dillon? This Har Ghar, Har Dil Tiranga holds a very special significance today. As we see images of soldiers at the border hoisting the flag, this isn't just some dikhava, sir. This is a way of life for every soldier. Yes. Har dil taranga, har ghar me taranga. We live our lives from the day we join the academies. Opening at the Lal Kila right now, General Dhil in freedom. Uh, the first speech was in Parliament. It was the next day. Many may not know this. August the 16th is when a speech was made from the ramparts of the Red Fort and ever since that has been the ritual. All Prime Ministers since that time, that since that first speech, have made their speeches from the ramparts of the Red Fort. Uh, Rajnath Singh, the Defence Minister, awaiting the arrival of the Prime Minister. Remember, all of these movements happen like clockwork. There are no errors, there, are, there is no mistake. Uh, ministers seated there, you can see Jyotiraditya Sindhya, you can see the outgoing Chief Justice of India, Justice Ramana, uh, other, other dignitaries, all waiting. And remember, since this is a, a maximum security location, because the Prime Minister is going to be there, nothing is left to chance. There is a high degree of security around this entire area. There's a lot of access control as well. Uh, you know, those who will be traveling down this road will know that uh, there will be certain restrictions as well. So I request all of our viewers to stay home for the next few hours. Enjoy the coverage here on India Today. You will miss none of the sites here on India Today.